Hi, I'm Ali Sealander with UTV Geo News, and today we're talking about the March 20th, 2021 eruption of the Fagradals Mountain Volcano on the Reykjanes Peninsula of Iceland. This has been the first eruption of the volcano in over 6,000 years. But eruptions occur all over Iceland quite frequently. In fact, the whole island is actually made up of solidified lava. This is because Iceland sits atop two magma-making monsters, a mid-ocean spreading ridge and a mantle plume. The Mid-Atlantic Ridge, where the Eurasian and the North American plates move away from each other, runs right through Iceland. Under this divergent plate margin, hot rock from deep inside the Earth rises to make one of our planet's biggest mantle plumes. Geologists call places where the mantle plumes reach the surface, like in Iceland, hotspots. There has been some amazing footage of this eruption. Even though the volcano is only 20 miles from Iceland's capital Reykjavik, so close that you can see the glow of the lava from the city, there have been no reports of any damages or injuries. In fact, the area has become something of a tourist attraction. But wait, people usually run away from an eruption, not toward it. Why is this volcano not as dangerous as others? Well, the answer to this can be best explained with a bottle of soda. This bottle of soda has a lot of dissolved CO2 in it. When I shake it up, I'm creating air bubbles on the inside. The CO2 in the trapped air bubbles are volatile gases that are just waiting to escape. If I were to unscrew this cap, the pressure inside would release, and the volatile gases would expand and escape, bringing all the soda up with it. Maybe not here. This same principle applies to volcanic eruptions. Magma has volatile gases dissolved in it the same way the CO2 in the air bubbles were in the soda. As the magma rises to the Earth's surface, the pressure gets lower, releasing all those volatile gases. The gases rush upwards, bringing all this magma with it, causing a dangerous eruption. We can see that the Fagradals eruption is not very violent, as compared to some of the other volcanoes we've talked about in previous videos. This is because the Fagradals magma does not have very much gas in it, as other more explosive and dangerous eruptions. Another important factor is the magma's viscosity, or how easily it flows. In this case, the magma has a low viscosity, making it quite runny, allowing the volatiles to escape much more easily, lowering the volcano's explosive potential. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the Fagradals eruption, and witness in real time how the island of Iceland came to be. I'm Ali Sealander with UTD Geo News, and I'll see you next time.